right now we are at uh, in Shikades, in the, the, the northern part of, of Norway, very close to, to the Russian borderline. Um, and it's a very, very beautiful place. Very beautiful. It's been dark for, for like three months now. I think in, in about two days the sun will come up again and you'll see the, the sun and I think it's like a gift that you know that the sun will come up very soon. I work as a, a guide up here and do everything from to making a fire to, to clean and to go up with the dogs, with guests. And to be with the guests, that's the most awesome too. To show the nature and to show the dogs. I'm a very lucky person. We have um, about 40 Alaskan Huskies. And they are our working tools, but they're also our friends. Every little dog has their own personality and sometimes a little bit too much personality. Yeah, my friends think I'm totally crazy doing this, but I think if they would come up here, they would feel that it's normal and not a totally mad thing to do. I think it's yeah, it's a lot of people get depressions because they need the sun and, and everything. So I think it's important that you know it will come, and then you 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 know that you just have to to be strong in the the dark uh, period, and then. You'll just see the sun again very soon, and yeah, you can just try to try to enjoy it as best as you can. But I, I think it's difficult to 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 have a good day without the sun. It's very different from day to day, and to see the northern light, it's like a fairy tale. And sometimes when it's really strong, you can hear the dogs they howling, and it just. It makes you feel like the most lucky person in the whole world to be so close to the nature. And that's the thing, to, to live up here, you, you, you live with the nature and you not live against them because the nature will always be the strong one. And, and I feel that's, that's a good way to live, that you need to, to work with the nature. And that's why the dogs are so much your teammate when you're up here. Then forget everything about snowmobiles and all, all material things. I'm really, really looking forward to to see the sun. I remember last time when I saw it after two months, I was so I, I was so happy. I was together with guests driving, and then I told them that we need to stop because I had this view. I could see the sun, and it was first time in two months, so I need to stop. I'd never seen the sun with so much color. It was amazing. I, I was so happy. So we, we def definitely going to celebrate it up here, definitely. But of course, it had been fun to try that don't have the sun but now after two months we're also looking forward to, to see it again definitely <laughs>